Indianapolis Metro Police tonight are searching for the driver who hit and killed a toddler right outside their own home. This happened on the near west side just a few blocks from the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Our Rich Nye talked with investigators who say the child's parents witnessed the whole thing. Police believe a gray four-door sedan was traveling south on Exeter Avenue at 18th Street around 6.30 p.m. Not dark yet. That car struck and killed a 21-month-old child. A vehicle was southbound and from the 1700 block that struck the child while she was playing in her driveway. And the uh, vehicle did not stop. And uh, right now we are conducting search for the vehicle. Southbound traffic does not have a stop sign. The car would have to be on the wrong side of the road, avoid a ditch and large rocks at the edge of the yard to have struck the child in the driveway. There's no indications that uh, the child was out in the street chasing a ball or anything like that. Um, all I can say at this point, all we know is that uh, the child was uh, in a driveway. The parents were apparently close by watching the child outside their home. They tried to rush the toddler to the hospital, but flagged down a police officer on the way near 11th and Tibbs. The child died at Riley Hospital. I'm Rich Nye, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Now, the parents told police a man was driving the gray car that hit their child. Of course, we will continue to follow this story. We'll have updates on the search for the driver, and anything we learn about the toddler, we'll be sure to let you know.